Holla Peeps, it's your girl Cherie reporting live for Cherie TV. Hey, did y'all hear about the girl that was, um, she was, like, I guess hiking or something, and she got disoriented, y'all, and guess what? She started having hallucinations, and she was seeing rocks and dirt as food. Y'all, the girl ate the rocks, and she was eating the dirt. When they found her, her mouth was full of dirt and rocks. Okay. That's some serious shit right there. I was like, oh, I got to tell the peeps that. Okay. Be careful hiking. Have some candy bars and shit. You know what I mean? She didn't have no candy bars. So she saw a rock. That rock looked like a, a s'more. Okay. So she went, picked up the rock, some dirt, maybe a little bit of mud. You know, the tails are still coming down. I said, oh, stop. No, she didn't. No, she didn't. No, she didn't. And for real, are you for real what you said? No, she didn't. I thought that was deep. Wow. You know that the mind can just get so fucked up. You know what I mean? Because you don't have food. Like you could pick up a cigarette. Pal mail. They cheaper. And they don't make me cough. You know, you like a cigarette, and you might not understand, you might try to eat it, you know what I mean, and waste of a good cigarette, damn it, you know, shit, if she was a smoker, she probably ate all the cigarettes, you know what I mean, had to resort to rocks, you know, hike with a buddy, Couple of them. Tell me. They're talking about Casey Anthony. Owen oh, money. Wait, I want to see what she'll play. I always I keep missing that. Okay, there she is. She cut her hair. Creepy bitch. There's a lot of creepy bitches out there. You know, fucking killing her babies, and killing her boyfriends, stabbing them 29 times. Poor Travis. This court's going to be in session in 45 minutes. I can't wait. I will be posting to the forum, peeps. You know what I'm saying? So, not the little rabbit bunnies from Easter. Peeps, people, the peeps, all of them. Go Louisville. You know what I mean? And that guy with his leg. Oh. I can't even think about it. It makes me want to hurl. You know? Like, imagine. Imagine all the people with broken knees. Bones popping out of their fucking skin. Can't even imagine. John Lennon was cool. I have the first Beatles album. I got it at a garage sale. Okay. That's what's up. Vinyl. Which you say I should put it on eBay. Nah. It's too precious. I've never played them because I don't have a uh, what's it called record player. But they look good. Barbara Streisand, James Brolin. No, I don't. Yeah, I think. Does, does he sing? Okay. 
The Carpenters? No, not the Carpenters. The other group with Mama Cass and California Dreaming. The California Dreaming people. I got that on vinyl. Vinyl was the bomb. If you got pissed off with somebody, you could just scratch the record. What's wrong, honey? The fuck you mean, what's wrong? Shit. You came home at 5 in the morning. Let me smell your dick. That's my new song. Baby's gonna upload. She gonna load that song today. Baby, are you still awake? She said, unless I heard her, sto her snoring, I could talk to her. But, yeah. Definitely. Definitely. That was my fault because I forgot. Okay? I shan't forget today. It's a great song. Let me smell your dick. You gotta go listen to it. I should post it to my Facebook page. We should have a dance party today. You know what I mean? That's a good one. Let me smell your dick. Ladies, that's not a bad idea. You know, when your man comes home and, you know, he looks a little bit too happy. Okay, the boys don't make him that damn happy. And tell him, look, let me smell your dick. You know? Same for the guys. If you think your woman is cheating, smell her pussy. And if it smells like rubbers, that's it. You need to talk. That could eliminate a lot of cheating. That's a very smart song, in my opinion. You know? It's very brilliant, actually. It's poetry. Now, don't forget to go to www.shereeandbaby.com and order my single, Love Lullaby, which I happily sign for each and every one of you who order it through the site. Now, when it goes in stores, it won't be signed. So that's what's special about about Love Lullaby in this stage. So I'm really happy with the way things have been going. I want to thank everybody who's already purchased one. It makes my heart flutter every time I hear um, the feedback from you guys. I love you. I really love you. So, anyway, look, I'm going to go ahead and cut this because we're at 746. You know what? I'm going to push it. I'm going to push it to 12. Push it good. Mm. Uh, 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 uh. Push it real good. Yo, 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 baby pop. Yeah, you. Come here, give me a kiss. A baby was two years old that Cookie Monster pushed over. Come on, let's get to the trial. It's 8:23. Jody Arias, crazy bitch. Let me open up the forum. Let me open up the forum. What you say, y'all? So we can get our Jody Arias on. Okay. Let me go ahead and copy it and put it on my Facebook. Okay. Your girl is on the case. Your girl's on the key, on the, on the, uh, your girl's on the case, Pete, that's what it is. Holla, spit it out, Sharice, spit it out, spit it out. There it is. Let me make sure it went up to Twitter. Oh, Justin Bieber, how are you? I'll tell him. 
Great. You okay? Now we'll see if he responds. Because Justin Bieber really is a very cute kid. He's just young. He's been thrown into this adult world. Let's see if he really cares. This can't be the real him though. Like, oh no, it is. Well, hopefully, yeah, 37 million followers. Look at them. Oh, you cute little kid. I hope you make it. Like, you know. You know what I mean. Y'all know what I mean when she say he's sweating Selena Gomez hard. She's like, leave me alone. Leave me alone. God, don't you have friends you can play with? He like, Selena, Selena, I love you. Oh, Selena. I could be your boyfriend. Oh, um, please let me be your boyfriend. She like, no, no, go to a concert or something. Don't you have groupies that you could be talking to? No, Selena Gomez, I love you. Please, please don't kick me to the curb, Selena Gomez. I'm just a believe. I believe. I believe you. I'll be a believer. I'll be better. <laughs> that's it, that's first love and we're just witnessing it we've all been through it, come on now everybody but baby, cause I'm her first love you know, she was very lucky but most of us know what that feels like that, ah. Uh, you know what I mean? You want to call, you want to stay up and look out the window and see if they're home, maybe do a drive-by, you know, psychotic shit like that, you know what I mean? Like, it's crazy. But, you know, you got your fans. You might not have Selena Gomez. She got a lot of fans that look like her. I'm just saying. Trying to give a youngin some advice. Oh.